Cut. Hmm, two conflicts here. That's cool. Already is legs of bullshit. Whatever. XP plus two SP. Churchyard that we can do with Luna, technically, and then get her plus two SP. Doesn't seem too bad. Firebird dwelling. Not seeing any ruins or anything, though. Let's go Brissa over here with haste. Papa. Could do the black tower to one hive, two hive, and there's ruins. Two hive, black tower, ruins. Gonna do the churchyard with Luna. Hey, Gleaser. Nice XP. Nice, no, um, no. Fortunately, we didn't get the fire magic that we needed, eh? I guess I can do it next turn on Stormies. Might just do that. Take Scholar, might be useful. You have Vacious too. Oh, Taurusar has tactics. I should have done the uh, thing with him. I guess I can do it on you, Vacious, though. Don't even need to use clone here.
Well, I don't know. This map looks like it, it could be playable, but I'm not sure whether we should. It's nice to have a lot of air elementals. The two hives are okay-ish. But the road looks like it's not going to be very good. Of course, there's an upgraded stack. Straight hives with side heroes. Evacious with clone. Could work. But I mean, only two hives. And the road not being that good. I don't know. Opponent says plus. I'm going to think about this. Yeah, I think 1-1-1, one, 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 guys, because we only see two hives. Looks like the road to the break is going to suck. And the opponent pluses, you know? This, this, this doesn't look amazing. We had a good start with two Conflux heroes, but I think, I think uh, with two restarts and with the opponent plusing, we're going to look for something a little bit more high rolly. Maybe, maybe he masturbates. We got a box. It's possible. Masturbate surely is possible. See, the roads were better here, though. Monair, you should have showed up earlier, buddy. Two ruins that we could try to do there. Ninety of them. Let's see what the box be. 5k XP. Expert fire already. And 4 SP. That's a pretty good start. However, we need objects. 
objectives. Thought this was gonna be a mini. I hit one once. I'm okay with that. Well, we got a lion shield of courage. Alrighty, alrighty, alright, alright. Legs of Legion again. We also got Grindone and Sandro, two heroes with slow. Okay, some XP for Luna, XP, XP, Churchyard, and then Lion Shield of Courage. Sounds about right. Sounds like that's going to work out. That's going to be Gold Shackles. Could level up Grindon to Luna, boom, 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 boom. Can I actually just clear that thing on white? Could just do the churchyard, but I th think... Are we going to get two levels? No. I think we should do this. Come on, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Really don't want to use a firewall. Hmm, I guess I should have waited, huh? I guess I have to use a firewall, huh? Yeah, I should have waited and repositioned instead of defing. I thought that maybe with def I wouldn't lose one, but... Alright. Uh, bit sloppy there, but oh well. I actually already have expert fire, so I might not even need to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should have brought army. Should have done that. C5, C plus 3, neck 2. What is this? Port. Psychic dwelling. Roads don't look good, though. Q 
Churchyard, churchyard, three spell power. Do we go... Do we go for the ogres with three spell power? I think so. Next turn. Well, this has to be good enough with only two, with only one, uh, the road again. The roads have been really bad for some reason this evening. Hey, yo. There's a box over here too. So Lion Shield of Courage, box, churchyard. Wow, more spell power. Okay, this has to be good enough. This is a ridiculous amount of spell power. Boom, boom. That's already... Plus 13. That's 16 spell power. Yeah, after, after we get this, 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 and this, we can just go for the break. All of this is burnable. Go for summons and mage. Well, maybe this is level 4 magic or level 5. Two pickets. Is this the way to the break? Really? Yeah. Yeah, we got a, a bit of a shit road to the break, unfortunately, but it happens, I guess. One more hive. So we have two hives and three pickets also. That's pretty good. <clears throat> Actually, leveling Grindon would have been okay, but we didn't really have <clears throat> a way to level him. Tzor. <clears throat> so, 1599 ogres with 160 damage. They have 40 HP, so I burn four of them, right? Right. All right. Let's see how that works. Brissa. No, we don't have one, one, two. Actually, getting Magic University sounds like a good idea here. Mm, can we get some wood? Magic University so I can um, buy Earth and level that. Because we already have expert uh, fire. Let me go grab this wood and ore. <clears throat> Uh, well, we're hoping we don't fuck up this fight. Because if we do, we can't buy back Luna and replenish our mana. That would be a huge fail. Four firewalls. No upgraded stack. That's good. Okay, it takes three firewalls to kill them. They will have morale. I can utilize one of these things. Try to anyway. Question is how?
I, I think I know. I'll use one firewall like this right now. Move everything here. Okay, not too bad. Okay. I'm gonna check out their positioning first. Actually, I think I'll do a firewall now. Yeah, it's a little bit annoying with the six stack here. These guys should die. Actually, hold on. This guy moves, that guy moves the 10 stack, and then that one. Okay. But the 10 stack will, or the six stack will probably go around. So now better try to get this 10 stack to burn too. Okay. Only problem, not uh, like this, I think. In that case, hold on. Okay. Like this and like this, it's fine. Yeah. Perfect. <clears throat> ah, I have the moves to pick that up. I have to just replenish my mana without the shield, unfortunately. Damn. Yeah, because I can't pour mana, I don't have the gold for it. Oh well. That kind of sucks, but oh well. Then we go for the box next. I might do this on Stormies. Yeah, I'll probably, I probably do get Stormies because then I can do the diamond golems on Stormies. Uh, 
Yeah, it would have been awesome to actually replenish our mana with that, but oh. We'll replenish our mana again before the break, so we should have enough for everything. Let's see what the break is in before it's something. In before, yeah, I was gonna say gold dragons, in before it's gold dragons. We do have two utopias and super far away too. That sucks. Can't get through, huh? Okay. All right, uh, I think we're going mage guild. Wait, no, I need ore. One more hive. Gems. One more picket. One more hive. And an SOJ. That's pretty solid. That's pretty solid. And we got the two Utopias, too. Haha. Somebody was asking questions. Sorry, I didn't see them. I'm uh, I'm a little bit too excited about this. Trying not to fuck up. Another legs of legion. Okay, so we'll grab that. Now we do that. Do that with Stormies. Yes. What's the Stormy tech? Wait, does it need an ammo cart though? Does the Storm tech need an ammo cart? I forgot. Too getting cold. <clears throat> mm. I don't I don't think you need it, right? That's it. So it's pretty much the same thing as Veleska, right? Mm, or we go Mage Guild. Nah, we go that. Yeah, and we kind of want the upgraded uh, things to do the picket, the first picket. Alright, so... 
Same positioning as with Valeska, right? Right. I guess I could have also bought air magic. Oh. Hmm. <clears throat> And there's the armor of wonder, as if, uh, you know, we needed it. Okay, one firewall should be enough here. Just bring pixies. Ah, where are you going, Dick? Remember? Alright. Level 4 or 5 magic? That would be nice. Yeah. 
that's that's also all right. I I will not say no to that. I think we go uh, we try to build up mage guild now though. Yeah. <laughs> or man to replenish mana after this maybe. Hey, dick. Mysticism or Diplo? Hmm. Hmm. We do have the Utopias. Yeah, I should have bought air. But, um, yeah. Mysticism, I feel like we're going to have a lot of mana anyway. So I think I'm going to go Diplo. Replenish Luna's mana and then do what? Send it for pickets over here. I can do that picket on somebody else, I guess. Jalar, maybe. Especially with the spell power. Then figure out the SOJ later on. Grinden, this hive. How do I get to this picket? I'm not sure. Like this, I guess. I can send Jalar for that. And I guess I can send Luna for this. Already start going for the break and whatnot. And grab the neck later with somebody. Nothing over here to farm. So it's hive, picket, 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 picket. And hive over here and hive over here. Okay. Investing in Mage Guild, aim. Eh? All right. Give the army here. He does that. Then he goes for the other picket. Position Grindon. Somebody else over here to grab this stuff. And grab that. Next turn, I will want to have... Okay, so Luna is just going to be going this way. And then I'm going to want to... Do I have shield and stone skin? I do have shield. Wait, where did I see more gems? Over here. Yeah, it looks like we're not going to be able to get Mage Guild. I mean, it's just going to take us too long. I think, I think we just go break uh, with Luna. We go break, we farm the SOJ and these two pickets and uh, this hive. And then also uh, these two pickets and then this hive. Why did we end that hive? And oh, fourth hive, yeah. And 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 then try to break with that. So I think that's the play. I think that's the play. Yeah, I know. Uh let's try to roll shield, I think. Haste or bless. I guess we can do bless. Haste. Haste is also good. Bless is probably better though, right? Because we're going to be fighting gold dragons. Haste, mass haste. And we're not going to have mass haste, are we? All right, let's go. Hello, the Naga's guarding. You guys see? I can't quite see.
Quest Mercury. Buy water now. Sounds legit, guys. Too legit to quit. Ah, uh, yeah, with water, right? Bless. Sure. Speed neck, also a good thing. I'll try to roll shield. Uh, wait, but we don't have, don't have gems left. Oh, there's gem, but. Hmm. Don't have haste on this. Wait, what? Thirteen spell power, magic arrow. It's also gonna be good. I feel like I can't waste the moves to pick up the gems with Jalar. Oh, there's gems. Okay, nice. Good. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's 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 much better. At least give <laughs> mass dispel. Fuck you. Hey, 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 don't do that. Well, I lose a pixie. Oh, wait, do I lose a pixie? Oh, yeah, I do. Or maybe not. Aha, don't lose a pixie. Fuck you. Fuck, come on. Another picket. Probably splitting these guys here. Seems like a good idea. Mm-hmm. Your morale is no good here, bitch. Magic arrow again, just in case. <laughs> the, 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 why did it have to be that one that morale, huh? It had to be that motherfucker that morale, huh? Out of the three stacks. 
Fuck you. <laughs> Dick bag. Yeah, yeah, it was my fault. It was my fault. I know. Should have stayed quiet. One more picket here. All right, so here, chain over here, then to grab this SOJ and Hive. Then chain the army to Luna or someone. Luna goes here, so 114, 115. It's going to be a 116 break, hopefully. And we farm these two pickets, this Hive and this Hive, and maybe that Hive. All right. Let's just make sure that we can chain this. All right, looks like uh, you're done. Or whatever. But I still didn't scout what those Nagas were guarding. Nope. All right, I need at least one more hero. There's Alamar. Damn, would have been nice to teach Luna Resurrect, huh? That would have been really nice. All right. Why break into 5x5 square mid? Yeah. So, just need to figure this out. Just need to figure this out. Just need to figure this out. Well, we get Alamar. I could have learned haste from Brissa, by the way. Oh, yeah. Chain neck. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Okay, so we we'll go here, take that, bring that back. Probably can't do that picket. Bring all of that back to Solmir, not Solmir, Grinden, so that we can do this and that. And then we have to set up a crazy ass chain for these two hives, these two pickets, this hive, and to Luna to break. That is uh, pretty fucking crazy. That is insane in a membrane. I right, get rid of this guy. Yeah, I mean, definitely looks tough, but. It definitely looks tough. Okay, I guess I'll probably get rid of Sandro. Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, somewhere over here, eh? I guess I needed the meat for the hive too. And farm some of these some of these money objects too. Should have gotten plus one defense, but whatever.
Okay, I probably have to go around with Luna. One one say it can't be one one five, one one six. All right, let's go. Hopefully this guy doesn't morale. Oh, what the fuck did I just do? Okay, fuck that up. Uh, 14 is gonna go. Okay, I'll we'll have to do it like this then. Yeah, fuck that up a bit. Uh, I, was, I was supposed to block that 12 stack, but oh well, I think we're fine. Not gonna waste any moves because this chaining is really tight. Kill the demons with Alomar, get him a little bit of XP. Can do the churchyard with Alomar on the way back.
do that on the way back, I guess. Brendan have magic arrow? He does. There's no morale. Thank you. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, uh, you fucker. It's alright, at least we shot the Minotaur Kings before that happened. Still quite solid. <laughs> Pretty nice stats for a 115. Yeah, Alex does do that. Don't take it personally. Alex does do that. Don't take it personally. Somebody should really talk to that guy. You know? I think it wasn't the clops that Miss Merle. Big hive is good. Let's hope we don't get too wrecked by Miss Morales. 
that's pretty much what we expect to lose, right? I don't even, I'm not even gonna, pretty much what we want to lose anyway, so yeah. no clops, you know, not even gonna contest that. All right, cool. Uh, ruins. It's been done before. Uh, those kinds of crimes and transgressions have been committed before. All right. So we have that. Now, what do we need? We need this. Then we need, uh, I don't know about this hive. That hive looks a little bit too far. But we need this, this, and this. Yes. That is correct. Mm. So how do we do that? Mm, let's see. So we have build a marketplace here because we might need to trade for some additional gold. I also want to um, get Alamar these churchyards so that we can level them up and get some additional gold too. Now the chain, the chain, the chain, the chain. Jalar also picks some shit up over, over here. Whatever the fuck his name is. All right. So we do that then. Walkton, Alamar, Ryland, Ryland here, Tizor, Tizor. Uh, okay, we can do we can do this, right? We can do this with Ryland. Tizor can grab the army from Ryland like this, right? Right. And then he can go for the neck and this hive, right? Right. Next, next, we can give the army back like over here somewhere and have Merlanda. Merlanda, 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 grab the army kind of like this, right? So hold on, grab the army, do this, and then we can get back like over here-ish, right? So Merlanda, you know what? I should probably just put you in the town. Yeah, that's the best idea, I think. I think I should just put uh, Merlanda in the town and get one more hero because I will need one more hero. Uh, you know what? I And then, yeah, uh, I need one more hero. Let's go ahead and, oh, I bought a marketplace. I should have bought uh, uh, upgraded pixies, would have more movement. Um, right, so hold on a minute. So, boom, 400, boom, then here, boom. Then one more hero, boom, Brissa, Brissa, okay, Brissa. And Brissa goes boom. Kind of like that. And that last hive I won't be able to do. But how do we do these two pickets and one more hive here? That is a bit tough. That is a bit tough. So hold on a minute. That hive we will be able to do. Brissa, I'll need at least one more hero here. Probably not doing the hive, but maybe I can do the two pickets. So who would I get rid of then? I don't know. Doesn't seem like I can get rid of anyone. Oh, wait, yeah. So I'm also doing that. I'm also doing that. Merlanda, Tizor. Okay, I guess I get rid of Jalar. I get rid of Jalar. I don't pick up the scroll. I'll, I'll get that stuff later. Yeah, I have to get rid of Jalar because I need one more hero for sure. Over here next to Luna. Yeah, let's go for the rally flag. That's going to give us luck and morale. And one more here. So Brissa will be able to chain this to Luna, I think. We need, uh, we're going to get the two pickets. So one more hive and two pickets, and that's it. We can't really do anything else. Brissa. Two pickets. Uh, I don't know if I can do both of them. Delay the break by one more turn to farm both the pickets and both the hives. We'll see. Uh, but this is the best thing that I can do right now. 
Unless I want to get rid of Alamar and set up one more hero there. I might actually. Mm, but but that, that way I can teach Resurrect and I can go back. No, I can't get rid of Alamar. No. I can't do that in good conscience. I guess I can get rid of Walkton. I guess I can get rid of Walkton. Hmm. Really don't want to, though. Because then, then the chaining here is going to be a bit scuffed. So I think we're just going to do it like this. Ah, right, let's go. Give me. Speed gloves would have been nice. All right, a lammer. Let's go. Skipping Earth, of course. Tabard, too. As if we needed more spell power, guys. We also got a Tabard. And there's the scholar. All right, then. We'll grab the speed neck. It might come in handy. That was not cool. That was not cool at all. But do we have Diplo on Luna? Yeah, we do.
Ow. Dicks. Well, hi, eh? Thirteen wyvern, twenty two elementals, and clops. Delay the break by one more turn so we can farm two more pickets and hive. Oh, I don't know, man. Speed up a bit. Seems like it's not enough army. What if this is a res scroll? Well, it's because our army is not that great. Yeah, we have really good stats and we can use stone skin and bless and whatnot, but it's problematic. I mean, gold dragons are fucking problematic. And then next turn, we're going to be way stronger. Because we'll have an additional two hives and two pickets. Right now, we can only farm one more picket. I think we probably should make the discipline decision and, and delay, yeah. Because right now, we just lose way too much. We just lose way too much here, unfortunately. Yeah, I think uh, delay is the right answer, I think. To get rid of Walkton. Maybe poor man Grindon. Shackles. I mean, I'd probably rather grab the pendant. Where's the shackles? Yeah, might be able to. All right, so. Set up for that. Go for that hive. I guess um, in this case, we could have just biome gamed a little bit better more and uh, farmed the utopias, but but uh, still, 1-1-7 uh, um, break is not that bad. Uh, I guess I have to get rid of Tezor, unfortunately. So we farm that hive with Clavius, then Rion grabs the army, he can do the shackles. Well, let me go ahead and move Merlanda out. Actually, no, I'll keep Merlanda here. So I can keep Grindon here. Yeah, okay. Keep Grindon here, replenish his mana. Well, would have been nice to replenish his um, mana with that. Should have thought of ahead a little bit, but oh well. So we'll keep Grindon there. And then here, Merlanda can go. Like so. And like so. Right, then Brissa. Uh, 
Just need to make sure that we'll be able to farm this next turn. I think like this, Miriam is the one that farms the hive and then the picket. Merlanda probably is the one that farms that picket. And then Brissa just goes here. Maybe farms that. Yeah, I think like that it should work out. And Luna, well, let's do this. Okay. All right. So we farm that chain over here, grab that, also probably grab that scroll, grab this scroll. Merlanda farms that picket, gives it to Miriam. Miriam farms the hive and the picket, gives that to Brissa. Brissa grabs that and through that chains that to Luna and Luna breaks. All right. I think we're good. Let's go. And then maybe if we can reach the town. By the way, where is the town? There's a side town. So do we go for the side town or for the center? Hmm. They're both close to the same distance. So probably we go for the center. It's kind of annoying. The road is, is annoying, but oh well. Red tower. Shut up, losing stuff. Small hive. Can I though? It, it looks like they may not be on conflicts terrain, but anyway, I can't do it. Oh, with well, a speed neck, right? That's true. But anyway. Well, Morgan, uh, game's going all right. I mean, we have this from our biome, and we're breaking 117. We were trying to break 116, but it didn't quite work out for us. So now we're breaking 117, but it's gold dragons. So I think a delay is uh, acceptable.
<laughs> one more hive and another utopia jesus ice bolt scroll all right then Shouldn't have gone for that scroll. Oh well. Grab that one later. Looks like we can't do that picket. Maxi? Uh, the object sizes were not really cooperating, but oh well. I can do the picket, but then chaining is going to be scuffed for Luna. Yeah, it's just not too greedy.
Probably better to have this. Like that, I guess. Doesn't matter. Less clops. Cure wyvern. Plus does nothing. Cure wyvern, I guess. Bloodlust. Maybe just save mana. Save mana or save a wyvern. No. We're likely not going to be able to replenish our mana before the final fight, but if anything, we can go back to our biome, learn, resurrect, and do the utopias. So... Nice morales. Thanks, dicks. Okay, now Bless can do it. Only 10. That was the mineral of them, too, by the way. Four clops and one wyvern loss. Well, that's acceptable, I'd say. Spellbinder's hat. Let's go for that. Spellbinder's hat and air tome. I think that's the right call. Um, oh, why did I have the speed? Oh, whatever. Doesn't matter. 26 SP, firewall, mass slow, magic arrows and shit, whatever. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot to rehire him. Thank you. Thanks, Yonuts. Appreciate that. Yeah, I can DD. Try to firewall somehow with a one stock. I put a firewall up over here. No, over here. Over here. Try that. 
How much do I even burn? Do I burn? How much do I burn? 620. I don't quite burn them. Hmm. That kind of sucks. Stone skin, magic arrows. Yeah, I don't really, really burn them. I would need a double wall to burn them, huh? There's no way to do a double wall. Over here, I guess there is. Bless on the clops, maybe better. Yeah, it's it's a little awkward. Uh, I could use lightning bolt. But I want to conserve as much mana as possible, so... Try to bless the clops then. Fuck you. Dude! Are you guys fucked in the head right now? Four morales? Are you serious? Or three morales? I mean, still. Alright, I just gotta brawl and use magic now, I guess. Try to kite back with these one stack wyvern. Nope. Didn't really give a fuck there. Right. Okay. <sighs> That, that triple morale really fucked this up for us. It really did. Offense, expert air. I guess I'll take offense. Mm. 
Nice level two magic. Okay. Protection from air. Fuck yeah. Topes in our biome. One more hive in our biome. And two more pickets in our biome. Okay. Let's view air real quick. He is in the center. So the big question is I think we go for the side town to replenish our mana. I think that's what we do. And just try to win with mana, basically. Yeah, I think that's what we gotta do. Yeah, I mean, I can't really attack him. I gotta have full mana. Gotta have full mana to fight. Thunder Helmet. Well, probably not gonna wear it because he could potentially reach me if he really tries. Another Gold Dragon break into a Conflux Biome. All right. The problem is we don't have res. If I had res, I would wear the shackles, but but uh, I wear the shackles anyway. Yeah. The good news is that we get our full mana, so. Our magic should be okay ish here. And I just wonder if I can reach him with DD. No, I can't. I have to try to farm as much as possible around here. Genies, Wyvern, and stuff. Oh, wait. I'll have to replay this turn anyway. I'll have to replay this turn, because most likely. All right.
Yeah, I can grab it. I can grab the anti-chain neck, maybe also grab this hive. Try a chain for that. Let's see, anti-chain neck. Frost ring. These fucking spell scrolls are clutch. Okay. I mean. Because I can kill something for XP, but... Level up. Yeah, pick it over here and pick it over here. Hasn't been done. What well, legion legs? Oh yeah, those. Right, right, right. The loins. Yeah, you're right, actually. Shit. Yeah, I should try to do that too. Come on. I'm gonna do. I feel like that's gonna be a little bit tough to beat because he has good stats and it's Jadid. He obviously is gonna have Earth Magic. So we have Alamar who can teach Luna Resurrect like that. Oh, there's a cons and another hive. Yeah, we go. We go back to our biome, guys. We go back to our biome right now. Yeah, put those meatless flour dumplings in my soup, yes.
Yeah, so I think we're gonna go for this taupe with Luna on summons and res. And then afterwards we'll farm Hive, Picket, Picket, Cons. Uh, we can go back here, farm the other two topes, do the other Hive. I think that's what we're gonna do. Maybe think about that Picket too. Speed ring would have been nice to grab too. Anyway. So Alamar teaches Resurrect. Everything else we can't really do right now. Just set up for it for next turn or something. Air Orb, that would be nice too, by the way. Can't lose against the Jadid, the Sodomite. Chain Lightning Neck, yeah. Now, Grindon knows Rez also. Pick it over here, pick it over here, hive over here, hive over here. So let's set up to do all of that. Okay. So we'll just bring the wyvern that way we can only use one res that I have a res right sure one more sp isn't gonna hurt or do we do pick it instead Pick it next turn and then DD poor man somehow. Let's see. Or maybe pick it on Merlanda. I'll probably pick it on Merlanda. And then Luna DD poor mans. And then we chain the army back and then Luna does this. Yeah, okay. That sounds pretty good. Let's go do that. Oh, crap. If I only had a thousand gold. Graded stock. So. Uh, 
Oh yeah, Diplo. Oh yeah, and we can Diplo shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sounds all right. Small one. Only a size one, fuck you. Yeah, if I can double mana, that would be sweet. Crown of Dragon Tooth, well, I mean, it helps with some spell power and shit. And Luna will be DD poor mounting next turn. So Merlanda goes like that. Luna DD Pormans, we give the army here. Valeska, right? You're gonna help bring the army to Alamar. Alamar does this and that. One more hero. Grindon here. You can also DD, give the army here to cult. Something like this. And then cult can go do this. I should get one more hero there. Let's get rid of walked in. Something like that. That should work. Okay, so farm that picket, farm this picket, farm that hive, farm the cons, farm that hive. Yeah, all right, I think we're good. Diplomat's ring, by the way, probably grab that too. All right, let's do this. Alright, we better not get stuck. He even has some behemoths? Wait, is it a stronghold center? Okay, he got a behemoth box somewhere. He's gonna want to try to attack me. Alright. Big one, nice. We have the speed neck on, good.
So that's two. The problem, if I slow, I cannot do... If I slow, I can't cast um, Dimension Door. I think I have to do it. Oh, what the fuck did I just do? Wait, Alamar can DD actually? Yeah, that's good. Try chain back somebody who has DD. All right. I need the pendant. No, I have two Diplor rings, Kevin. Okay, yeah, because there was one in the Utopia. Caesar has good moves. Lydia can DD. All right, time to go taupe. That was a little dumb, actually. Or
Nice toe peel. Nice fucking taupe. Uh, well, I guess that's it. Oh, wait, I forgot to do that one hive. Okay. That hive. Right, he has that Jadid still here. Got it. Makes sense. So, uh, let me clear this guy. Yeah, because Luna is going to need to go this way and then pour him on that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, first we clear that. Yes. Okay. Um, Orlando. Orlando Grindon. Brendan could replenish his mana too, by the way. That would be good, I think. A little bit of mana, at least. Buy him back before we run away. That load, yeah. Not a whole lot of time to think about this. Let's just go. Do we have any other... Oh, so everything's on Luna, right? Our Tome and all that stuff? Alright. Hopefully the other Tope is... A little bit better than what we've been getting from the Topes. Oh well. And then we'll need to chain that out, huh? Well, or we can keep it, the army here, it doesn't really matter that much. Now Luna loses, uses Fly and one res on the Wyvern, should be fine. Well, 
something like that, I think. What else? Yeah. Maximum spell power. Gold golems. Do I want to take some gold golems? <laughs> do, we care, do we care about gold golems? I mean, they could they could make some shit difficult for the opponent for no mana. But anyway, I don't think we're gonna. I think we'll save it for something more worthwhile. Little small one. All right. These are the stats that I want, right? Yeah. So there's a size two. Green. No shield, just res. I'm losing some wyvern. How much do we res? We res nearly all of them anyway. We res all of them. It's three wyvern. Well, intelligence. I'll take intelligence. Mm hmm. Topes were not that great, to be honest. It's all right, though. Oh, and we have to sack a clop or a wyvern. So we'll do a wyvern. And get Brendan some mana too. Brendan has. Okay, I need one more hero, I think. I need one more hero to set up to do that. Okay, Leonis, this. We'll go here. Alamar Merlanda. And dragons, that other picket. And we'll position Luna like over here to go for that center town, I think. He'll probably attack me with Jadit, but that's okay. Okay, and, 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 and. Um, yeah, another hero. Uzor. Lodia. Chanel Mark. Here. That. Here I am. Does have expert scouting. Can get rid of Merlanda. Get Alkin, I suppose. Okay. Go that way. That. And Brendan Samana. Boom. 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 And boom. That's it. Okay. That's about it. Six 
and do mage global all right all right um Tiny one. Have magic arrow. Oh, that was kind of dumb. I wanted to uh, be able to kill them, but with only one magic arrow. Oh, by the way, I really wanted the air orb too. I forgot about that. Oh, well, anyway. Uh, one more hero. That guy some mana.
Guess I can leave some arties here. One of the spellbinders hats, this and that. Bead neck, I think everything else I bring with me. Cast fly. Thanks for the cheer, Seven Soul. Appreciate it. Hmm. I can firewall, actually. Yeah, I can. Another utopia, by the way. Maxi. It's interesting. Hey, 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 go out. Okay, I can't do anything else. And grab the speed ring. All right. I still had moves over here. This would be the most efficient way to DD. I guess I gotta go like this. I'm 
not sure if I'll have the moves actually to reach him. Speed boots, those would be nice. Speed boots and speed gloves. It's a grin then. Line of sheer mana. Unicorn box. Might as well try to go for that. Hive box, sharpshooters. Or is that a box? No, nah, it's a sack of gold. More unicorns. Do I want to diplo those? Doesn't sound bad, honestly. Anti-magic aura and shit. I'll take him. Makes our army stronger. Does give us minus morale, but I think I'll take him. Hive or picket? I think we'll go hive. Hides us more. Minus morale is definitely a bit annoying. Yeah. Oh, wait, I have minus two like this? Shit. Do I maybe have the Pendant of Courage on then? that for, for the magic resist aura shackles so anti-morale anti-morale or not or, i mean plus morale the stats are still not that amazing if we had full full mana that would be great but yeah we have to use blind dd we do have cure. Right. 
Yeah, I'm thinking. Plus three spell power. Or the morale. I don't know. Morale and luck. Yeah, I'll do morale and luck. All right. Okay, I have Grindon who will replenish his mana. Try to take that down and try to TP. Oh, wait, uh, Mage Guild. Okay. Hager pick some shit up. Clone an inferno. All right, so oh, there it is. Well, we have the shackles on us. He has a little bit of interference. He caught us. Sixteen speed. We have fifteen speed. So that ring would have been a big thing. We do have a shit ton of mana though, so this should be relatively even, I think. Our stats are close to the same. And we win in terms of mana. And we have res as well. So honestly, I don't mind this. <laughs> yeah, he viewed there, obviously. The plus morale thing he also has. Looks like he also has the Pendant of Courage. Yeah, I mean, we have double his mana. And we have Shackles, so he can't retreat. So... Pretty much the same stats. Comparable armies. So, question is, would we implo? Use his haste, all right. Is he going to be casting on the clops? Wants to use the genie casts, obviously. Yeah, summons, resurrect. We don't have blind, though. So, yeah, I do think we win. I do think we win. So, might want to summon, might want to summon right away, actually. Frenzy on the Ancient Behemoths, okay then. Summon, and we hopefully take out the Angels and the Firebirds. Oh, he has Anti-Resurrect on, wow, okay. Okay, well, we both die then. We both die, but we still have Grindon. Yeah, it looks like we both die. So actually, summons are not right, I think. Mm. No, summons probably are right. Okay, didn't attack. Yeah, we both die. We both die, but... I think we do have to summon. Shane only kills 15. Implo kills 30. Yeah, I do think we summon. Okay. So now what? Kill the firebirds, kill the angels as much as we can. Shitters take out the Firebirds. We 
Wyvern hit the Angels. I think. Also, we can maybe blind the Angels. Nice. Nice. Okay, angels are dead. Nice. Oh, angels are not dead. That sucks. In that case, maybe we hit the genies. I'll just hit the genies. Anti resurrect ring. Do you see the corpses are disappearing? Not a neck. Did he? Okay. Anti-magic aura, maybe, maybe the wyvern will resist whatever the hell he's gonna do. Nope. Well, we both die. We both die. We'll summon again, just in case. I do still have Grindin with Rez. He has Solmir with Chain. I have Grindin with Rez. He has Solmir with Chain. But we both lose our armies. And Grindin also has Spellbinder's Hat. No, they both die and they go... Uh, they're either gone from the pool or they go to the bottom of the pool. He has Earth Orb. His Implo is doing a shit ton of damage. Noah, did you hear what I just said? Either they're gone from the pool or they go to the bottom of the pool. Anyway, we just summon until he exhausts all of his mana and... Uh, It's 
funny that he put the anti res on. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting a uh, resurrection specialist to use anti res. That's funny. I'm just going to keep summoning, though. He only has three more implos. He obviously has the Earth Orb. He's doing a shit ton of damage. Question is, what other Arties does he have on, on another hero? I might ask for a draw, but honestly, we may be in a better position than him. Because I can do the other Utopia on summons with Grindon too. And he only has one more in plow. Nope. Nothing left in our biome. An altar of thought, some magic elementals pot potentially. Mm -hmm. Yep. Nice, slow. Whatever he's trying, it's not going to work. Whatever he's trying, it's not going to work. All right, we're both dead. Um... Magic arrow. Yog doesn't have magic arrow. I could do the other Utopia now if I just had magic arrow. Um, somebody with enough mana there. But it looks like it's going to be next turn. I actually wait. Maybe this will work. Maybe this will work on Yog.
Dog doesn't have a spell book, but maybe like this he can kite a little. Same. Yeah, Luna's not gonna be. So, Grindin, we do have the Spellbinder's Hat, so that's something, but we don't really have a whole lot of spell power, unfortunately. Hmm. How's this gonna go? Is the question. Four. Or what? Why, why would I want to buy already merchant now? Anyway. Mm. Oh, for SP? Oh, okay. True, true. Yeah, I kind of do need SP, actually. Gleaser, thanks for gifting a sub. Yeah, I really do need SP because I won't be able to do Utopia without SP and stats. Yeah, I do have mana, but yeah, that's probably a good idea. Try. Fifteen and three. Looks like I will not be able to. Speed six, I won't be able to kite them either. So we'll have to wait until next turn to take this. Oh wow, I didn't even, okay. Well, now Melodia is gone, fortunately. I guess Alamar can get mana too. And Arting Merchants, let's go, I guess. Right, do we have any black markets anywhere? Where else can I get spell power with Grindin? I do have that tunic. That tunic is nice. Yeah, so I have the plus plus four. Oh, yeah, so I have the tunic. So there's nothing else that I can really buy for spell power. Yeah, no need for that. Yeah, I do have the tunic. All right, uh, let's get Alamar. And let's replenish his mana too. Legion pieces. There was one over here, but I didn't check it. All right. So this guy is going to be doing that next turn. Alamar and Grindon. I'll just position you to poor man next turn, I guess. Yeah. So, eight spell power, eight spell power, expert earth. It should be doable, right? 32, 32, 14 attack, some defense. We'll see, I guess. Uh, what else do I need? Um, not the arty merchants, but try to reroll level four, right? Uh, what? Res or Frenzy, eh? I mean, I have Res and Alamar can just teach it, so. Might as well take Frenzy, I guess. Totally not what we needed, whatever. All 
Anyway, try to do the Utopia next turn. Yeah, there's a couple of genies left, eh? We're Solmir genie, no firebirds, giant. So yeah, he doesn't have much. This is going to be tough for him. And uh, yeah, if we can get that Utopia, there's a refugee camp, by the way. Utopia, also air orb. Yeah, and also grab that. Uh, what else do we need? So we replenish our mana. And then Grindon is just gonna grab this from Alamar. We build some altar of something. Water. Fire. That makes sense. Fire, I guess. What do I get? Level 3, level 2, and level 4. I can get Altar of Fire, I guess. No. Ah. Could even build Fort here, but I don't think I'm gonna. I think I uh, want to keep my gold. We do also still have... Wait, do we? Oh, shit, I fired him, huh? I fired Ryland. That sucks. Um, Brissa. That's true, caper necklace. Yeah, you're right. You're right. But I don't have that many resources for it. So anyway, we'll see. All right. So Grindon is gonna pour him out. We buy him. So we take the town with Nimbus, uh, pour him out Grindon here, and then Grindon goes for the Utopia, kills the giants with summons and res. And then does the Utopia. Somebody like Yog finishes the Utopia. Well, probably need one more hero, actually. Let's get rid of Leonis. Wait, no, let's get rid of D Rock. Should put one more hero over. Oh, yeah. Let's get rid of D Rock when I can't fucking buy another hero there. It's excellent. Mm -hmm. Two conflicts heroes, better buy them both. I guess I can leave this not here anyway. Really, all I need for Grindon is that. Is that really happening? I don't have magic arrow. I believe that shit. No, it's not enough mana. But I think I can outkite them.
Jó. Not having magic arrow was annoying. Just a little, just a little. Sorry, I'm sorry I didn't take your butt into consideration. Oh wait, we have blind? I don't, I don't hold, how do we get blind? Where did we get blind? The Labessa? Did Labessa have blind somehow? The fuck? Wait, we got, oh, we got level two magic, didn't we? We do have blind now, okay. Ah shit, I really should have bought fire magic for Grindon. I need fire magic and, um, Air magic. Oh, Deemer Meteor Shower, yeah, you're right. That's good. That is good, actually. Shield here helps also. Doesn't really matter if they're Titans. I mean, our shitters are pretty good. There are Titans. Yay. Intelligence, basic or water, cultic intelligence. Later. Nineteen defense that should work out. By Deemer, just in case we have to surrender or retreat or whatever. Or so over here she can DD. By 
Okay. Now we do have that meteor. Uh, it's better to get Demer mana rather than Labesta. Yeah, probably. How does Labesta do anyway? Always buy Earth for these guys too. Alright, let's go. Nice two. Okay, so we're gonna corner up here. Shield skin at least. Nice taupe. Nice fucking taupes we had in our biome, guys. And wings are okay, I guess. But, but Jesus Christ. That's out the ass. Four man? Oh, I can actually four man. Actually, four man and replenish my mana at least. Wings is good in Black Orb. There's our mana at least back to 42. Right. And then we need to grab this. We're gonna need to pour a man him again. DD pour a man. Grab the firebirds. Boots of speed and all of this stuff. We need to grab. We. So steamer. So we can chain some army that way. And this better buy it. Alamar, what can I do with you? 
Just get the town portal. Did we already roll this turn? Resources. Right, let's try to roll this turn too. On town portal. Chain. Shouldn't have accepted frenzy. Chain is not bad. Oh, by the way, we should buy air magic and stuff. But do I op do I keep the slot open for town portal? We do have meteor. Chain is also good. Um. Yeah, I shouldn't have kept frenzy. That was that's kind of stupid. Gotten rid of that. Thing is, I don't really have a whole lot of resources for that, except chain. Uh, let's not forget to buy air, and I'll buy fire too. It does have firebirds. Oof. He has army. It does have army. Well, crappy army, but. It's a bit annoying. That is a bit annoying. So he got firebirds from that biome. Yeah, I should have bought Earth. Thank you for, for the sub. We can use a blind loop, we can indeed. Okay, uh, right, so how do we do this? Okay. Still don't know what the hell these Nagas were guarding, I'm curious as fuck. Right, um... Altar of Thought. Bethic and DD. Better buy Earth for Alamar. He'll know chain too. I was gonna get the other air thing. Oh well. Never mind, now I can't.
Leave the psychics here. Try, trying to build the uh, magics. I only have 11 SP. I had 12 already for some reason. Thank, thank you so much for the five dollar tip. <gasps> Damn it! Oh wait, I can. Do I thought I accidentally pressed accept. Yeah, that distracted me. Don't do that shit. <laughs> There's that Diplo again. I don't think we're going to take it, though. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oof. Wow. He actually has firebirds on both heroes, eh? Hmm. That's a bit tough. That's a bit tough. Armor of Wonder. Or do we have we have Alamar here, right? Four spell power. He has chain. It's chain and meteor. Okay, hold on. I gotta I gotta think about this. Hold on a minute.
crap. Familiars, yeah, that totally helps. Try to do the warrior tomb, I think. Might give us something. Ooh, 141, that's a lot. Over though. Totally. Totally helps. Mm -hmm. Alamar. Alamar can't reach, though. I have to try to reach him with... What's his face? Solmir or Elishar? for Elishar first, I think. Use Deemer to chain or to Meteor. Some of this shit. Yeah, so what the hell? Oh, pff, quest already. Great. Hive. Un more hive, eh? One more out. So should get one more spell power. Can try to attack. All right, so Deemer. How is this gonna go? What do we bring with us? The water alleys? Water alleys and one stacks. That against Elishar, right? Let's do that, I think. Try like that. I don't need the ballista on me for... What's his face? Yield, trident, and stuff. Actually, you know, I shouldn't even give him the. Shouldn't even give him this. All right. I'm just trying to check. Do 
16, okay. Good. 161 mana. So 16 speed is good. Did he do chain? Yeah, he did. Close to. Kill the firebird, nice. Can I? Hundred. How much damage will I do with seventeen? Okay, perfect. Just enough. Good. Kill the firebird. So that's good. If he kills my demon, I'm fine with that. Oh, asshole. Damn it. <laughs> that sucks. Does he have Earth? He must. That sucks. That sucks for us. He has Earth. So, question is, do we fight Elishar first, or do we fight the other dude, Solmir? They're both going to have a lot of mana, it looks like. No ballista. Yeah, no. Oh, I thought we didn't have chain for a second. I was like, where's our chain? Where's our chain at? Hey, Lilith.
So what is he going to do? Is he going to res surrender? He might do that. Memorial can. On roll. On roll. Roll. Yeah, it looks like he's going to res the bird and then surrender. Fortunately, his genies have first move. And unfortunately, I feel like versus Solmir, we might just die. Oh, he just he does chain. Okay. Bad, we can't blind the golems. I can anti magic the birds, though. That's what I'll do. But then he still res surrenders. So hold on. Figure out how we can do this. Because I can blind the obsidians and then res. I'll kill him anyway. What else can I do? No, yeah, but um, the bird is not going to move because of the weird res mechanic. I mean, I have to res the bird, obviously. Oh, it will. It will move. Okay. Okay, I don't understand this mechanic, honestly. All right. Um, The problem is that I won't be able to kill 11 golems with one hit. Thirteen will definitely not kill nine. Wow, I can't even implode them. See, like I could blind. I have black orb. I forgot. Shit. I can blind the golems. Fuck, 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 fuck. Hold on a minute. I can't. I can blind the golems. I forgot that I have the black orb. Okay. Um, if 
Pianta magic, I think he res surrenders. But yeah, I think anti magic is probably the right call. No, I can't. I can't. Um, I don't. I don't kill them. Um, if I if I were able to kill the gargoyles. Yeah, I think anti-magic is the right call. You can still res, I think, because it's a single spot. But I, I actually, I could have blocked it with my uh, Firebird. I should have blocked it with my Firebird. Yeah, you should have told me that <laughs> in, and before I skipped my turn. I should have blocked it with my Firebird for sure. Yeah, because I think here he's going to have to rest Surrender. Yeah, and that's, that's what he's going to do. Because he has he has two hexes the fire uh, the fire Ellie's yeah see and he surrenders, yep. Yeah, why why where were you two seconds earlier and to say that with the firebird? Uh, come on. All right. Two firebirds. Speed seven, I have speed seven. Those things die. That, but the angels don't die. Yeah, birds die, angels don't, genies die. And then he's gonna chain my birds. 269 mana. Wow, it's a lot. I'm quite expecting that. No, Meteor is worse because um, we have Air Orb. Meteor is not very good. But uh, I think we summon here. I think we have to summon here. He kills me around two, I think. Because he can chain, and then he, he can chain me twice. He can chain me twice because I don't kill his angels. So, I have to summon. It's the only play. Not unless he has mass haste. But yeah, Dominia Loy, if you said that just a little bit earlier, I would have realized that I can block him with the Firebird. Ooh. Interesting. How did he How did he chain like that and not kill anything? It's kind of weird. So but no, nah, but he should have killed the firebird though. Magic mirror on the giants, okay.
Did he did he bolt the earth, Ellie? So like, what the fuck? What the fuck? I don't understand what happened there. Oh, uh, oh, his fucking his bird moves first because of my ballista. Fuck, I didn't need to wait, huh? Okay, his bird moves first. Damn, that sucks. They have minus morale. Oh, he doesn't. Anyway, he can't kill the summons, so. But yeah, I didn't need to wait with my bird. Really genies, I guess, at least. first so I'll need to either rest surrender or chain surrender I'm not quite sure which is more valuable to me right now okay doesn't kill me It's kind of a weird play, actually. Oxy down. Okay, he wants to leave me with just summons and surrender. All right. Cool, I guess. Yeah. Looks like he's gonna be surrendering. The problem is, is that now we... Okay, he's not surrendering? Why? Why are you not surrendering? It's a little weird. I can now kill your angels. And your birds. Yeah, or do double earth too. He's gonna have to surrender though, I think. I don't really get what the hell's going on. I can rest surrender, yeah. But... I think I'd rather try to get him to lose some stuff. Almost. It's close. 12 HP. Nice 12 HP. Well, Firebird and Angel, but the thing is, he has a Firebird left. Now, if he uh, keeps a Firebird, or like if he allows me to do a Res Surrender, we're gonna do it. He doesn't know that we have Res. Oh, he does. He does know that we have Res. No, I don't lose Grindon. Grindon goes back to the tavern. No, if we both, if he dies, then we both die. That's how I lost, uh, that's how our mains died. Our mains already died in this game, dude. It's 3 a.m. Fuck. Yeah, this was, <laughs> this game <laughs> was a bit of a mistake.
Well, Angel is fast because of his mass haste. Cast mass haste. What was that? That was weird. Could use mass slow, but doesn't do much. Oh, that's what he was doing. And now he surrenders. Or what happens? Maybe. I can't kill his bird. Oh, I can actually. He still goes with the. Yeah, I can't. Uh, but but he'll kill my bird with the behemoth. No, he won't actually. Whereas bird, kill bird and surrender. Not the worst idea in the world. Yeah, yeah, behemoth does not kill. You're right. Res bird, kill bird, and surrender. Or we can chain. I want to try to chain from the angels, I think. I want to chain from the angel. Res bird, kill bird, surrender. Doesn't sound bad. And we replenish our mana. So that also doesn't sound bad. Chain from Ballista like a boss, yeah. Good implode, angels. He still has a fire bird left, which is the problem. Yeah, if I res bird, kill bird, and surrender, that's probably the best idea, honestly. That is probably the best idea. But... The thing is, like, if I go greedy right now and try to, like, chain his angels or something, he probably will. Yeah, he probably. Okay, let's let's do that. Let's do that. At least this way, he only has one bird left. So let's do that. Where's bird? Hit clop. Kill bird. Surrender. At least we killed two birds. Uh, yeah, if we were a little bit better at killing his... Whatchamacallit. I grind in back here by Mage Guild. Hmm. Another hero. Okay. Replenish mana. He's not going to reach me, right? And even if he does, I can surrender. This is the question. So he has the Firebird. He has Fire Ellie's. Oh, he might Arma. Well, if he Arma's that, that would be kind of bad for him. Okay. Um, let's see. So, if I bring Alamar, he can Mass Haste. 
but he still doesn't kill everything, right? He can kill one, two, three, four stacks. Right, okay. So I think, I think we use Alamar. Yeah, I think, I think you're correct, actually. So we use wings, army, and stuff to Alamar, right? Ruins. That. I think so. Maybe. I mean, uh, but we don't really have any other options, so. Uh, Spellbinder's hat on Alamar so that he can DD. Let's go. Need the ballista. Oh, but I can't DD with Grindon now. Fuck. Hold on a minute. Something like that. Like that. Okay. Shield just in case. Or just in case. Kill the Firebird, eh? Yeah, he won't be able to kill me. Oh, I, I didn't buy back Grindon yet, huh? These are some sick showdowns, I gotta say.
This is, this is one of the sickest games I've ever had. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Next level guerrilla tactics. I'm gonna do a quick ad break. I think I'm gonna turn off my lights, or at least one of them. Mm -hmm. I thought he was gonna try to do. Still can't kill me though. I actually killed the... Actually killed the Earth Helis. Yeah, morale's neutral. Oh, actually, he yeah, has bad morale. Suicide and kill Firebird, you think? Why suicide though? Oh, because I attack. Right, right, right. Um, okay, right. But I have no retail. One, two, three. Yeah, 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 you're right, you're right, because I can't uh, surrender, right? Ah. He will res the bird. Fixing won't block it though. Oh yeah, okay. If I do that and I do that, I think that should work. Okay, this way he can't res. I think. Well, now we're gonna see. Now we're gonna see if if you can res a two hex unit when you stand on one hex. No, oh, okay, good. That's fine. No firebird then. It's good. Mm. I can't reach him. I actually don't reach him. I actually do not reach him. But that's all right. He doesn't have any more firebirds, so. Wow. How many moves? 11 moves. Second DD. All great, all great points. Arma Bomb, second DD, all great. 
If we had Arma, and if second DD was possible. Second red tower on left side town? What are you even talking about? What's second red tower? You mean this one? Anyway. He's got firebirds again, motherfucker. He keeps getting firebirds. He just keeps doing it. Motherfucker just keeps doing it. Alright, anyways. Was more money? Mm, I do. Get one more spell power. Let's do that. Oh, wait. Shit. I wanted to give Deemer this. I guess the rest of the artists do or some shit. Or Brissa. Oh, I can do both. Yeah, so he shouldn't reach me. This would be, yeah, too many moves for Elishar, so. The only problem, though, if he reaches me with Solmir, that would be a problem because then. 
could actually kill me. Could actually kill... Well, no, he can't. He can't kill me. Unequip Black Orb. Um, right now, it doesn't matter. Right now, I think it's a good idea to have it because he has Golems and shit. I have Psychics. We do have Labetha also. No, I can't. Uh, couldn't kill Solomir now, no. Well, if we kill Solmir, we can kill Elishar. Fuck you. Take the black orb off. Oh, it's good. Okay, not even going to use Dimension Door. Okay. 
Now I kill four angels, actually. If we can somehow only leave the behemoths, that would be nice. So let's see. Chain on the giants so that the firebird also dies. But then he can haste. Kill firebirds and then use chain and kill. Do I have to summon? Do I summon? Feels like I probably have to summon. Chain like that, the firebird dies, but he hastes, kills my firebird, moves again, uses chain, kills the magic alleys. Yeah, I have to summon. And I'll def with a firebird this time. That way I get to move first with it, unless he hastes, of course. Okay. And what? Surrender? I guess he can surrender round two. I guess he can surrender round two. That's probably what he'll do. That's probably what he'll kill my magic ellies and surrender. Uh, unless he doesn't have the gold. He might not have the gold. He may not have the gold. have minus morale that would be so awesome if the angels and the birds miss morale next turn it'd be pretty awesome but yeah i think he may not have the gold to surrender it's four angels that's 6k four giants Three behemoths and a firebird. That's a lot of money. 7k, 8k, 9k, 10k, 11k, 12k, 13. That's like 14k. Yeah, he's not going to be able to surrender, is he?
won't be able to do that. So I guess even if even if you stand on just one hex even if you stand on just one hex you can still uh you still block the res Well we had more gold than him before I'm not sure maybe he gathered some gold Although he was buying a lot of heroes too, so. Yeah, okay. Taste, makes sense. Chain Giants. Leave something to blind, like the behemoths, hopefully. And now he can probably surrender. He flees. He didn't even surrender, so he loses the Firebird, too. No. Okay. So he's got nothing left. Okay. Oh, 
buy a bag grind in here and then grab the speed boots and this stuff. Well, on one th uh, on one four one, all of this shit starts over again because I get more firebirds and he gets more firebirds. Because he likely took a few firebird dwellings in this conflicts biome. That's where he got his firebirds. So I don't know, man. Five more hours. And we do have more gold than him, even like this. But he has no army left at all now, so let's go. There's genies. Oh, he's got genies. But it's gonna be no match against our fire bud. Alright, so the spellbinder's hat here. I guess we gotta do this first then, huh? Or do that first. So, we'll go that way. We'll get the wings. So it's no problem. Wings, Rissa. Yeah. Who should have this shit in Conflicts Town? Definitely have that shit in Conflicts Town. Brendan. Um, 
I do that. I format that. Right here, I guess. I actually built Citadel, but it's not too much anyway. Not much money. And, um, so now, Brendan. So he uses wings. Uses DD. Doesn't use DD. Wings. Or just in case, something like this. I don't know. I have a weird feeling. Wings on some. So. Go check that out. Here, and we're going to go okay, and then we need to set up the chain gunner there, that hero here, Labetha there, there, and that's it. Except that here. Yeah. Sounds about right. Okay. That's it. Yeah, Firebird again, of course. You're vicious. Get some of the earth ellies too, but I feel like we're pretty good here though. I feel like we're gonna be good. Nah, we're, I don't think we're gonna get earth ellies. Just this is gonna be fine, I think. Whatever. What else did I wanna do? Oh yeah, the Lebe um, Brissa thing. More pixies, fuck yeah.
will have more gold than him with like no gold. Sure, that's impossible. Okay, black orb is not on. This is on. Okay. He has minus two morale. Yeah, see, but he, he has no firepower. He has no firepower to kill her. Yeah, okay, figures. And now what, surrender? Clearly, you have to surrender, because if you don't, you die. Okay. Finally. Finally, Solomir is done. Stables. So you should probably still have Elishar, right? What artists did I get? Ring of Suppression, Sack of Shit, Fire Orb. Blah, blah, blah. Not too good. Put the fire orb on. Indeed, Grindon does not give a fuck. At, uh, we need some more. Money. Have place. There's a marketplace here. Let me trade then. Okay, over there. Mm. 
And there's the yellow char, so he's done. Mage gold here, so Yavacious can kill him with just magic arrow. So what's up? So, both his heroes are gone. So, which way do I scout with Miriam? I guess this way. Uh, Two Thunder Helmets. Arlach should kill him too. It's probably his last hero. Get the spellbinder's hat so I can back. Ten. Well, GG. You gonna GG now, buddy? No? Maybe? Think about it. Think about it. What do you mean, who has money? No, he just ran away.
Cause I had no idea where you got all, you get all this gold. With only three towns. He won't be able to reach me, so I better replenish my mana like this, I think. I can surrender if anything. Chain surrender. Right, right. <laughs> yes, GG. <sighs> G fucking G. All right. Cool. One one eight six. Uh, that was fun. That was, uh, yeah, that was, that was a war of attrition right there. Oh yeah, that was, that was definitely hard earned. Let's see. One, one, eight, six. Whew. All right. Yeah, pretty sure this will go up on YouTube. Uh, he's he was saying uh, um, I don't know where you got so much gold with only three towns and uh, he was like yeah it's a big question afterwards he was uh, he was like yeah good job uh, I I hope that it was worth it and then he was like oh, yeah I, I don't understand where you got all that gold and I told him I had four topes at home and. Um, yeah, so close to 500, can almost smell it. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, and then he, he was asking where I got summons, uh, I told him I had two Spellbinders hats and one, uh, left one of them on Grindon.
<laughs> He's like, damn, you ha you have you have uh, one biome and you've got everything. Two spellbinders hats, uh, four topes, and uh, and I told him, uh, we want Tome. And I told him, yeah, it happens. And I also had uh, plus four all and plus five all <laughs> in the biome. I was telling him about uh I was telling him about the um uh castle game. I'm like, yeah, it happens, man. The other day I had a game against a castle guy who had uh three portals without restarts, three portals and uh uh four utopias and broke like one two two uh with like fifteen archangels and twenty all and uh tome of earth, tome of air. I couldn't do anything. Anyway, that's the game. That's the game. Wow, the dude still this the dude play is playing more <laughs> crazy. Wow, he wants more. That's insane. After that game, seriously, that was like that was a long ass fucking game. Where 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 the hell is he from? He's just like I gotta get another game in. Gotta gotta get the crack. Gotta get the crack. All right, we'll like Chev bomb. All right. Uh, what was I gonna check? What was I trying to look at? Um, this is, yeah, the last battle, right? Let's see what he had left. Yeah, so all he has is Gundula and Cassie. That's it. We got rid of all of it. Yeah, just, just a Jambroni Cassie. Yeah, he doesn't have anything left, really, so. I mean, he could try to fish out Solmir, and oh, he did have double mana too. He could try to fish out Solmir, but didn't get into this biome. Did this Utopia? Huh. Oh, I guess he saw me over here. Must have scouted. I want to see that turn when he actually attacked me. This biome actually looks pretty decent too. Consas, Utopias, the Dungeon Town, three Consas. Did he even do them? I guess they were small or something. Yeah, the Firebird Dwelling. So one Firebird, there's another Hive there. Firebird Dwelling and Red Tower. So that's where he got them. Okay, good. I'm glad he didn't have more Firebirds because this would have dragged on. Did still have a couple of hives and stuff. Did have a utopia here. Let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, well, it's 141, clearly. I wonder what was in this warrior tomb, by the way. Vampire Scal. Level one, Yona. Okay. I have anything else in my biome? Not really. Some shitty scrolls. Protection from Earth. Misfortune. This might be an interesting scroll. Fire Ellie. Okay. Inferno. Well, it's almost Armageddon. Was in this box, I wonder. Water at least, okay. This one. Hmm. This is some kind of magic. Let's see real quick.
I will, I will. Yeah, I feel like I should have gotten the gloves earlier. I would have, uh, would have been able to reach his Solomir 11 moves. That was a mistake, though. Tier 4. So that's the Arma. There's our Arma. Tier 4 magic. What's in this one? Well, it's week 4. Forever. Uh, okay. Check what was in this Utopia. Did he do this one? Must have done it, right? Was in this one. Tier three. Not bad. Not bad. I guess he didn't really have the tools to do it, though. So. Yeah, spell box would have definitely been good. Uh, yeah. Let's see what these boxes were. Eighty-two of them. Well, eighty-two week four. Okay. Also tier four maybe. And rocks. Yeah, hold on, let me, let me try that again. Uh, spacious. Let's see. Feels like it was also tier four. What? Tier. Okay, on some else. Oh, it's tier two cannon. Yeah. That's a bunk. Mm. Okay, I want to check. There's the Earth Tome here. This Tope would have been alright. Yeah, this biome looks pretty good too. What about this biome? This biome is just some hives and whatnot. No Utopias. Let me check. I want to check when we fought. That was like what? What turn was that? Um. Yeah, I broke one one seven, but then I went back to my biome. Oh, he broke. Uh, yeah, I think either one one six or one one seven. Also, uh, because he was in the center, but he was red. On. He was in the center of town. Um, I think on one one seven. Yeah, like over here, we were over here, and we lost. We just lost a lot of army, and this is this is how weak we were. Well, this is how I mean we had we had good um, arties and we had good stats, but this is the army that we had. So yeah, and he yeah he was already in the center town. Oh no, yeah yeah, he was already in the center town over here. Was a pretty decent army. Lots of genies and stuff. Yeah. Uh, let me have a quick look at turn one. Yeah, we won. We won. Green Dragon's break, actually. He was able to do it. Good number of lamps. Looks like he played pretty well. Yeah, a lot of lamps. A lot of lamps. And... Interesting box over here. I wonder what that is. Um... So what did I want to check? I think he broke. It looks like he probably broke 117. 117 and reached the town. Um, 
Yeah, I wanted to check before the fight. What was that? Like one, two, three? I don't remember. Nope. It was like one, two, five. Yeah, over here. Now it was next turn. It was one, two, six. Yeah, desert was tiny for sure. That was over here, and this is where he attacked me with Judith. I had the shackles, but he had. It's weird that he had the anti-res ring. If he didn't have the anti-res ring on there, we win that one. Because we, we had double his mana, and we can just continue to... Yeah, he had the Earth Orb, like I said. Yeah, and double Teapot. We had no Teapot. Yeah, here we could have just... Yeah, and he had the Pendant of Courage, too. Also, yeah, if I saved, if I saved the Anti-Lightning Necklace, it would have been better, too. But yeah, it looks like, it looks like he lost all of his Arties. Let me see what Arties he still had left. Uh, where's his Solmir? Just the Thunder Helmet. Let's see. Next turn. Yeah, the fact that we had Grindon and that we left Arties was a really big deal. All right, so this is where yeah, he lost everything, and yeah, he has nothing. So see, he just he just had the thunder helmet. That's it, just the thunder helmet left. So see, he didn't leave any arties, which he should have. See, he wasn't expecting to lose. Let's see. Let me see real quick what arties he could have left. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So, he had a, a teapot that he could have kept, a water tome, a water orb, interference, this stuff, all this stuff he has on, I guess. But yeah, like all of this stuff, like at least a teapot, at least a teapot he could have kept. Which would have already been better. Might have won, might have won in the, in the game actually. But me, I, um, yeah, I definitely like all, all of this stuff that I had. I should have kept the crown, um, the crown and the lightning thing and the speed because I knew I knew I was gonna wear well, the speed okay, like the speed I can forgive because I wasn't sure which neck I was gonna wear. I, I made the decision to wear the um, pendant of courage at the last minute. But I was pretty sure I wasn't going to wear but I was thinking about it. I was thinking about maybe wearing the Pendant of Negativity. So that's why I brought it. But yeah, in reality, I should have kept... I mean, it kind of makes sense to still have this on me because I could have had this crown on. I could have had this on. I could have had this on. I could have had this on, you know, depending on the situation. But really, to be safer, I definitely should have left the Pendant of Negativity. And I definitely should have left the crown, and I also should have left the armor of wonder. This, the speed neck, and and this. Okay, I could have brought that because I was wearing this. I could have also left the speed neck because, uh, yeah, I was pretty sure I wasn't gonna wear that. But I was wearing the plus three, and then at the last minute, um, I decided to put on the pendant of courage instead, which you know, I kind of agree with because bad morale could have killed us potentially. So, but yeah, but, but if I kept the pendant of negativity, the thing is that, that like when, when I fought Solmir and Elishar later, the, he wouldn't have used chain lightning, you know, because like, um, later on when we had those fights, what, what, like one, three, three or something like that. When was that? Yeah. Here where he had Solmir, right. Um, it was actually a one, three, two, I think, right? Yeah, um, wait, what? Yeah. 
0.31. When was that? No, okay, so 133. Yeah, because they're. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 133 one, three is just, um, yeah, it's just my turn because I already got rid of his Elishar and, uh, and this uh, attack to Solmir. But here in these fights, uh, a big thing was his chain lightning, right? So if he didn't have the chain lightning, if he didn't have that, then um, let's see what he had real quick. If I had the anti-lightning pendant, that this would have been way easier, right? Because all he ha all he has then is ice bolt, well, ice bolt and magic arrow. He did have res. He did have res. But without ice, um, without chain lightning, without chain lightning, this is this is uh, easier for sure. So the pendant of negativity would have helped a lot here. <laughs> Whew. Okay, guys. Well, to whoever made it here, thank you guys so much for watching. That was that was a that was a marathon, man. I'm tired as hell now.